Happening now, TxDOT has started clearing homeless camps from under the city's overpasses. Large cleanup crews flanked by DPS troopers started cleaning at Ben White and Westgate today. This comes after weeks of back and forth between Governor Greg Abbott and Mayor Steve Adler over how the city should handle the homelessness issue. We have team coverage for you tonight. Christine Frizzow digs into how New York City is dealing with its homeless trouble. But first, CBS Austin's Christian Flores is live from one area that is set to be cleaned. Christian, people living there have spent the last few days scrambling. Well, here in North Austin, you'll see noticeably fewer tents set up with people living here, leaving behind trash they want TxDOT crews to clean up. But next to this abandoned area, this sign right here, pleading with the governor to come up with a more long-term solution, one that doesn't require them to uproot their homes. We've been up for days or all night long. Andrea Aguilar spent the day rolling her most important possessions away from the area designated to be cleaned by TxDOT. Starting Monday, TxDOT crews started cleaning up homeless encampments under overpasses across the city, throwing away anything left behind not put in issued bags. For those living here, that means uprooting their homes. This is painful for some of us. When we last talked with Jeff Melder a few days ago, he was putting together a makeshift cart to gather his belongings. Now. He's packed up and will leave this area permanently, saying he will now live in the woods. It's just uprooting everything every week, you know. It's just, it's just be like you almost, you know, move your house every week. The area is under the overpass that became a battle line between Governor Greg Abbott and Austin Mayor Steve Adler. For several weeks, the two have continued to take shots at each other on Twitter. This weekend, Governor Abbott sent out this tweet, calling Austin's policies unsafe and promising the state will step in this week. A spokesman with his office tells us that's in reference to these weekly cleanups, adding those will go on for as long as Abbott wants. We caught up with Mayor Adler this weekend. The concern is, is that uh, it might go beyond just cleaning up and might end up dispersing people. Now, this sign asking for Abbott's help has replaced signs asking for money, with people camping here caught in the middle. Permanent solution would be nice. Then there should be a bill made for that, or a law, or solution. Not just get out, because where do we go? And today, TxDOT was going to target three of the busiest areas. They have a total of 17 sites identified. Reporting live in North Austin, Christian Flores, CBS Austin News. With the new sit lion camp ordinance now in effect, Austin police officers are cleaning up homeless camps near the Austin Resource Center for the Homeless. Changes approved by City Council last month ban camping outside the Arch, the Salvation Army Homeless Shelter, and within 15 feet of the door of a home or business. Out of those 156, 65 were willing to identify themselves. And so we have a list now of 65 individuals that were present on Monday and that were in violation of the ordinance. Officers have been handing out pamphlets to people who are homeless with the new rules about the ordinance and service providers.